Hello everyone, welcome back to Nokia Gaming. So, previously we have completed to episode 3 of Quantum Break where I chose to trust Amaran. Let's continue with the next act, act 4. Let's go. This is kind of new to yeah. Okay, let's continue. You took the one thing Mr. Serene needed to survive, Dr. Amaral. That made you priority one. Yeah, they made that clear. Monarch lined every escape route with barricades, roadblocks. I had to get to the mainland, but I couldn't do it by car. Needed a new plan. All right, let's go. Beth, I think I'm gonna need a ride. The streets are too hot. All right, where do you want me? I'll let you know as soon as I find some higher ground and get a good look at the situation on the bridge. I think it might be a no-go. Gotta get to higher ground. Or I can pick you up. Let me know. I'm pretty exposed out here, so try to make it fast. I'll be a lot better when you get me on that boat. Monarch's right on my ass. I'm not exactly making friends out here. How's Dr. Amaral? Still kicking and screaming. How long do you need to get here? That depends. Let me check. Paul. What the actual fuck? Better get inside before the chopper spots me. Yeah, just looking for a viewpoint. Is 
So, we don't know where he is. We can't, uh, we can't find him. So we need to look into a, you know, a, uh, a replacement. All ponies are made of butter in Night Springs. Ah! There is all of us, lots of the Kratzu things happening in Gidu of Niget Springs. Thank you. All ponies are made of butter in Night Springs. We know the old dance, the fo um, fortunate and the destitute. The haves and the haves have nots. Those who dine at the table and those who starve in the street. But the tables can be over... Uh, th uh, but the tables can be turned. The gluttonous consumer may find himself the consumable resource. Do that again. And yet, that is the fate that awaits you in... Night Fringe. It's Night Springs. Night Cringe. Springs. Bright Blings. Night Spring. Fright. Wind. Jesus. We know the old dance. on Joyce or Wilder. Doing another sweep. I can't stay here long, Jack. You're gonna need to be quick. Yeah, about that. Bad news? Reoccurring theme of the night. I'm looking at the bridge right now. I feel like Joyce across that bridge would make sense. It's getting tense out there. If I go anywhere near that thing, there's going to be some people caught in crossfire. All right. Any bright ideas? Our fire. There's no way in hell you're going to get away with it. Calm down. You need to take a look at your truck. Uh, let me see. There's a pier under the bridge. You should be able to meet me there with the boat. Giant gas sign out front. Can't miss it. It's nice and bright for Monarch to see. There's not a lot of options. Switching to Monarch frequencies. Be in touch soon. Right, I'll be there in a few minutes. Don't stand me up. Okay, how are we getting down there? All right, there? Bobby's back, and we're getting Where's reports the of more and more of these Monarch roadblocks springing up all over town. Bastards. Search his truck. You heard Serene. We take the hard line. Easy on the trigger finger, but if it comes to it. Copy. Shut up! Monarch's got this 
checkpoint team, move down. in. Target has been spotted under the bridge. Dr. Amaral at risk. I'll make it across that bridge, whatever it takes. I need to get up to the bridge and cross it.
but I'll take it. The original be clear. What have we got here?
This is so bad. I knew I'd be dead if a stutter collapsed while I was in the frozen crash. I had to reach solid ground and the deck of the cargo ship was my best bet. Just had to find a way down. crash was a mess. Somehow, I had to find my way across. Hope for the best. towards the cargo ship. <laughs> the route down wasn't exactly user-friendly. The fracture was getting much worse. Timelines getting scrambled. Caught in violent loops, off sync, crashing into each other. This was what the end of time would look like. Everything was broken, in chaos, frozen. And no one would know. Okay. Come on, come on, come on. heading downwards, towards the cargo ship. <laughs> the route down wasn't exactly user-friendly. The fracture was getting much worse. Timelines getting scrambled. Caught in violent loops, off sync, crashing into each other. This was what the end of time would look like. Everything was broken, in chaos, frozen, and no one would know. Okay. Come on, come on, come on. was escalating. Objects were moving out of time, out of order, entire timelines overlapping. And it was going to get worse, unless we could stop it. You don't understand the power you're wielding. 
You need to hand this technology over to Monarch. I've prepared for what happens next. You say you're prepared, but no part of this plan of yours involves stopping it from happening. Even if I fix William's machine, what could you possibly hope to achieve? The end of time is coming. There's no way to- Hey! This isn't a debate. I just watched a ship fast forward through a fucking bridge. Time is running out, and the fracture's getting worse by the minute. And it cannot be stopped. Paul has been to the end of time. He's witnessed it firsthand. Can't you see? We prepared for what's next out of necessity. Your research is based on work by William Joyce. You respected him. He knew that the fracture would occur, but he also knew that it could be fixed. Will built a way to stop the fracture. This. The countermeasure. We're traveling to the past to retrieve it. You can help us get there faster. Or you can agree to disagree. I'll have to run diagnostics on the machine. I can't promise anything before that. Nick, take Amaral to the machine. Keep an eye on her. You got it. Welcome to the team, Doc. Don't make me shoot you. Jack, before we head downstairs, we have to talk about something. Okay, what's up? It's about the plan. If Amaral gets the machine working... We go back to yesterday and undo all of this. Listen, in the video Will left for me, he said the countermeasure was stolen from his workshop on July 4th, 2010. He also said I took it. Maybe I did, Jack. We have a time machine. You're saying we go to 2010. We steal it. If Will was right, that would mean it wouldn't be a change. We take the countermeasure, bring it to the present, fix the fracture, save the world. Okay. Explain to me why that's a better plan than just going back to yesterday and preventing all this from happening in the first place. Because I'm afraid that based on what I know about time travel, we can't change anything. The past has already happened. We can't change it. But my way, we don't have to. Yeah, I, I don't know. I mean, my plan still feels simpler. Let's just get the machine working. This was the guy delivering the speech at the gala. Name's Martin Hatch. According to Monarch Radio, he's been deemed a traitor. Sabotage to Monarch Lab. Potential ally? Mm, close. Hello, Riverport. It's Bobby Radford, and, uh, well, you know where we're at, don't you? The poor Donnelly Bridge is gone, and God knows how many people are gone with it. You heard that? Let's see how Dr. Amaral's doing with the time machine. Yeah. I don't think we can trust her. The way she looked at the countermeasure like she's seen it before. She knows what it does. You think Will told her about it? No. Will was never the kind to open up. I can relate. Will takes it to the next level. When we were kids, the only way that Will could express anything important to me was by informing my stuffed giraffe when I was in the room. It's precious. And weird. Did she find anything? 
I'm not sure. I'll go check. How's it look? The problem is quite simple, really. The power relay is down. You'll need to find a way to reset it up. There. Where the light is. I'll lower the ladder for you. What happened to the power relay? A power surge occurred at 7 a.m. this morning, and the machine was activated. 7 a.m.? That's hours before we even got here. Hey, Jack, come check this out. Well, the numbers don't lie. Hey, okay. I guess I'm doing Shouldn't some you be climbing. keeping an eye on Amaral? Sure. Yeah. Me from but I figure what I'm doing is more important. Okay, what is all this? I dug through the area and I found everything I could on your bro. You gotta see this video I found, man. Check out the TV. And everything else I, I put on those tables over there. Date is. Oh, the date is. It's, it's February 28th. Jesus, Will. 1999. William Joyce. 1999. After months First experiment. of arduous work, my machine is finally ready for human testing. Ready is defined by me, since ready is obviously a relative term when you're dealing with the deformation of the chronon field and recreating of black holes mass density by you know, tangent. Okay, in short summary, the time machine and it works. I'm gonna prove it or die. Okay, just need to make some final preparations. When I enter the machine, I will travel clockwise around the corridor. Okay, core is active, chronon levels are stable. I'll travel clockwise around the corridor, exiting back into the same location in the near future. Oh, this clock is set to my watch. Now, when I exit the machine, there should be a significant difference in time between my watch and the clock in this room. Corridor Looks like he tested time travel with rats place. first. Okay, setting the date to five minutes to Why the am I not surprised that Will's hamster test. was a test subject? Now, admittedly, it looks like Schrodinger got a raw deal. Much more impressive. But I can't travel backwards in time. Only as first activation. I try to forget that period. Oh now. my god. Okay. Please say there's a CD. Ready. Monitor is Dude, stable. I already got it in the stereo. Yes. Check it out. God damn it, you guys. Wow. You know, this song really uh, speaks to me. Uh, Huh. Your true weapon is obviously the healing power of my music. I mean, it's not even that bad. I could totally bone to this. Thanks, Nick. You've got to be kidding me. What is it? This is all my stuff from our family home. I kept everything. Hmm. Guess you thought you might come back. What's wrong? Signature. You made this? I've never even been here before. That woman in the picture is you, isn't it? So... Jack. There's something you should know. 1999. I was eight years old, playing in my backyard, and a woman approached me, told me she was from the future. She gave me very specific details of events that would come to pass. She gave me this. 
Filled with dates, events, proof of it all. Jack, that woman. It was you. Everything I told myself would happen, did. Every detail, for better or worse, came to pass and couldn't be changed. Our fate is laid out before us, Jack. Everything that happened to get us here, every sacrifice that was made, they're all a part of this path. And they can't be changed or undone. Beth. When we step in that time machine, you will see for yourself. All right. If you're that sure about how all this works, we can try your way. It's her. She's the one who's been painting all over the city. <sighs> Jesus. Notebook was full of dates, events that would come to pass, instructions. Her entire existence was formed out of those pages. Looks climbable. Exactly the kind of question that never would have entered Will's mind while building this thing. Hey, I think I can get to the reset from here. Of course. Shit. I'm still getting used to that. Don't expect to. Are green.
Any news on Monarch out there? Well, people are pissed as hell, but Monarch seems to be looking for you pretty hard. Been asking on a bunch of forums about your whereabouts. You want me to throw them off track? Uh, sure. Post that I was seen hiding in a catering van or something. Love it. Consider it done. Set the date into the console. July 4th, 2010. Are you ready? No. Are you? This is it. There's no turning back. Hey, wait, wait! What did you do? That was the wrong door. You changed the date. Where is she? Where is she? I had no choice. I couldn't let you take the countermeasure. It would put our entire plan at risk. I already called Monarch from the terminal. They're on their way. It's over. Fuck! We need the countermeasure to run the lifeboat. I'm gonna follow through with the plan, tie her up and get as far away from here as you can. Yeah, I've got this. Don't worry. Your first journey back in time, 2010. This is where our notes get hazy. You know how it ended. Your goal when you arrived was to retrieve the countermeasure. But my goal had to wait, because I wasn't alone. What's going on here? Since when did Will run a graffiti workshop? None of this crap was here in 2016. Someone's in here. There we go. Who 
the hell is that? The fuck are they shooting at? Dr. Emerald sent me to the future. I fought for months trying to find a way to get back. I wasn't the only one. set Williams' machine to 1999. The first possible exit point. Don't shoot! Okay, hey, don't hey, shoot! Don't hey, shoot! It's okay! Hey! It's okay! Ah. It's okay! I'm on your side. Who are you? I'm Beth Wilder. There's some things you need to know. You're the reason you built the countermeasure. And you've been here ever since. Eleven years. Why? Why didn't you come back? We should get ready. We don't have much time. She had changed. And there was a weight in her eyes. She was hiding something. She always was. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't fucking do this. What exactly do you believe changed in Beth? She lost hope. Will, where's the countermeasure? The countermeasure's at Williams' workshop, where he built it. Then that's where we go. Right, yes. That was the plan. Supplies are upstairs. We'll need to get them. There's so much you don't know that you never saw. I. 
I gave up on the idea that she would ever come. I need to know we're still in this together. I told you once our fate is already laid out. Hey. I still believe that. There we go. More than ever. I'm just worried what that might mean. It means we finish this. You need gear? Take whatever you need. The rest of it's going in the river. Along with everything else I brought here. That's a little drastic. My time here is done, Jack. I have to erase my presence. Let me know when you're ready to go. what happened to you when you entered that machine I wanted to go after you but I didn't know where Sophia sent you or how to find you you made it here it's all that matters you followed the plan whatever happened to you change it don't we can fix this don't we can undo this you we still don't get it <laughs> it can't be changed no matter what we do, the pieces fall in all of the exact same places. I've tried. Over and over. I can't just sit back and do nothing. You have to let go. Jack. You have to let go. I've seen it. The end of time. That is where she sent me. I was there. I've been fighting this fight my entire life, and I saw us fail. I saw where this leads. I just don't know anymore. I don't know if we can win this thing. finding out. I don't know a fraction of the hell that Beth went through, what she experienced when she saw the end of time, how that changed her, like it changed Paul, followed by 11 years of living like a ghost. Beth I'd known had laser focus. This Beth, she had doubts. 
You okay? Yeah. <sighs> but the countermeasure, the one thing that could set things right was waiting for us at Will's workshop. In 2010, Monarch didn't own the area yet. That came shortly after because of what happened with you. But we knew William was building something new in his workshop, and we knew it must be important. We were monitoring the place. Yeah, Beth knew about your presence. She'd done spying on her own. We came over the rooftops to avoid detection. Does Will know we're coming? No, he doesn't. I can't believe we're stuck working on the 4th of July. Who the hell took out the. Whoops, sorry. From this point on, we may be in their sights. We need to be quick. Hey, Will? He's not here. I made sure of that. What? Why? He's the only one that knows how to use the countermeasure. Which is why he needs to be kept safe. In case... things go bad. Fine. We get the device, then you leave me to my brother. Sure. Now, where do we find this thing? Will said he secured it inside a safe. Somewhere in the building. All right, Will. Where'd you hide that safe? April 2nd, 1999. It's been about a month since the incident. Since I was shot by the man from the future. Hey, River Boy. I'm pretty sure it's you wonderful. folks are having a better time than I am. There's some things you need to do. You're the only one who can stop it. Wish I could There's no You'd been there before. Witnessed flashes through time. I assume pieces of that puzzle had come together since. And some are yet to come. Let's see here. The device wasn't there. But it must have been at one time. It was all there on the board. The details of his downward spiral. His work consumed The power setup wasn't working. It became some kind of desperate obsession. But it must have worked at some point. He was never the same. Maybe I can rewind time to get this working. He was planning on giving it to you. Yeah. And it was Try to find a way in. Had the chance. Which means this is the only way it can play out.
This must be where he built it. Eleven years. Building this thing was his life for eleven years. Yeah. Shit. Shit. Locked, Locked out, again. out again. Where was the failsafe switch? switch? Follow the wire. Which one was it? Blue? Blue? Or was that the other one? Shit. Emergency shutdown initiated. Shit, shit, ass. ass. Fucking, Fucking god, god damn, it. damn it. Yellow wire, I knew it. Do it. He didn't leave the code, but I can crack it. I just need some time to... Somebody's here. It's Monarch. I knew it. I knew they'd find us. I'll take care of it. Just get that safe open, stay inside. Yeah. Okay. You'd been spotted the moment you arrived. You never had a chance. You were on a suicide mission. Yeah. I wasn't gonna lie down and just give up without a fight. Not then, not ever. This is Trojan One, approaching workshop perimeter, over. Remember, orders are to take her alive. Monarch Actual's en route. Roger. Stop right there, where's the girl? Hey, 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 hold on, take it easy. He's got a gun! Open fire! What the fuck was that? Shoot him! Get him! Thank <laughs> you. 
another shot. Come with me. We can survive this together. You know it can't be stopped. I can see it in your eyes. You know this. What if you're wrong? We created Ground Zero. Caused everything to happen how it always did. Every piece falling into place. Except one. The blast sent you through time. Brought you back to 2016. The same exact time from which you left. Something anchored you there. We need to know how you did this. You think I wanted to come back? I was pulled away. Everything I came for was still back there. Left behind. Serene had the countermeasure the whole time. I had to get it back. A rash decision. You claim Beth Wilder's death had no impact on your behavior, but... Like I said, I barely knew her. So, what you did next? It wasn't personal? No. No. 